Hi guys, um, welcome back to my channel. Um, today, first of all, I'm smiling, I swear. If you can't tell that I'm smiling. <coughs> oh my god, if you can't tell that I'm smiling, I'm really smiling on the inside. Seriously. <laughs> but anyway, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do something a bit different. I've had this pore cleansing, this charcoal pore cleansing mask for like over a month now and I've always been wanting to try it to see how it works I've seen other videos and it's been just the reactions have been crazy um I've cracked up and I've also felt really bad for the people that have done it so hopefully this does not bite me in the ass um I'm actually trying to rush because I've had this on just a little bit longer than I was supposed to. Um, I've been doing a bunch of little stuff that I forgot. And as I've been doing it, um, my mask has dried almost completely. You can kind of tell there's a little bit of wet marks right here. But they're not really that wet for real. Like, they're dry. But anyway, the charcoal mask that I use today is called the Deep Cleansing Charcoal Black Mask. This is what it looks like. Is it focus? Oh, well, this is what it looks like. I think I picked this up at like my local beauty supply store it was a dollar ninety nine so I was like yes I need to try it and by try it I was extremely excited because it does say dermatologist what is it dermatologist tested so right there I'm okay with that but anyway um this mask is supposed to minimize pores one that's great because I have humongous pores it's not even funny like which causes me to get blackheads a lot because if your pores are huge and then that just causes more room for dirt and debris and all the other nasty sh stuff um, to go into the holes of your face so if you really think about it it's really nasty um, before that I did kinda uh, what is it they say like they say you can kinda like extract your own blackheads by themselves but um, I did that just a little bit because y'all if I do that all the time like if I did that how I really wanted to do it I would have a pimple like say I, I extract my blackheads today I will wake up with pimples from everywhere so I'm really excited about this mask because I did pull out some of the nasty blackheads and this is supposed to minimize your pores so mm -mm -mm, hopefully I don't wake up with pimples or zit it but y'all it's like really stiff it really is so what was I about to say oh well the ingredients right I recorded this video so y'all can see me applying it on and how it looks when it comes right out of the package but you know my phone is real through anyways while this is pulling up I'm going to tell you what's in it there's charcoal oh here it is hold on I'm just trying to open it it was hard I don't have any makeup on. The only makeup I have on is my brows and just some lashes. But um, the smell, the smell is kind of yucky. Here I'm just showing you how bad my blackheads are in my huge ass pores. So I don't even think you can pick it up. You can see it on this camera, but they're there. And they want you to focus on only the parts that have uh, that you have big pores or blackheads so that's where I focused on I didn't put any on my forehead because I mean I got a little blackhead right there but I ain't want to go up that far y'all because <laughs> I'm actually really nervous I don't know if you can hear it. oh
So it comes out kind of thick, but they say on the back, put like a thin layer. I don't know, y'all. It's been almost 35 minutes since I've had this junk on. And anyway, that's just that's just me spreading everywhere and talking about how I didn't want to go right here because I have a mustache and now to think about it I probably should have put it right there because if I yanked it off then maybe my hair is what it came out to killing two birds with one stone you know <laughs> but um, I'm about to go ahead because I don't want this video to be too long and this shit has been on my face for far too long but I'm I don't know where to begin with this Oh my gosh, this feels like it's not going to come off. <laughs> Y'all. Oh my god! Let me tell you something real quick because I don't want this video to go too long. But I told y'all in my last first video, or if you've been following, that I have multiple sclerosis. Ooh, I regret this. I have multiple sclerosis. And one of my spinoff illnesses, because a lot of people that have multiple sclerosis have like a spinoff illness unfortunately but there's just always something else you deal with besides the MS y'all I have a very rare form <coughs> I need to take a break I have a very rare form it's called trigeminal neuralgia and that actually fucks up the nerves in your face I mean it doesn't fuck them up but your nerves in your face are fucked up and sometimes things will trigger a pain and I really hope that this does not trigger a pain and I'm really just kind of talking through this shit because y'all trigeminal neuralgia is is real <laughs> I can't talk. I'm sorry. <sighs> My beard. Anyway. That's it. Look at my face. Oh my god, y'all. My face is on fire right now. Did I regret this? Yeah, I did. But my face feels really good. I am not even gonna lie. Whew, I'm gonna take the rest of this off with makeup wipes. But y'all, if you... <laughs> I'll never do this again. If you guys like this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. I do kind of regret it. I'm about to go recover, but thanks again for watching this video. Um, yeah, I'll see you on the next one. Bye! <sighs> My God. Oh, it's still recording. Bye!